respecting individual differences, ensuring fairness in our political process, and navigating the harsh realities of a two-party system lie at the heart of today's political struggle. The response to Donald Trump's comments reveals that even those who might not share my views yearn for leadership that cherishes and honors each person's uniqueness. I haven't, but I'm hearing uh, reports. I have a lot of respect for RFK Jr. You know that. I've known him a long time. Very smart. A little bit different, and that's okay. But he's a very smart guy. Uh, he's loved by a lot of people, and I'm hearing that he wants to leave. Don't forget he was treated very unfairly. I think he would have beaten Biden in a primary. The Kennedy name and him in particular. I think he would have beaten Biden in a primary, and they made it impossible. They said, you have to get 70% of the vote just to qualify or something. They created standards that nobody could have met. Biden couldn't have met him. And I think he would have lost uh, Biden, and uh, they really treated him very badly. Then he went out as an independent, and it's a tough thing to do, independent. You know, it wasn't set up that way in the country. It's really a two-party system, whether people like it or not, Republican, Democrat. And I have spoken to him in the past, over the last uh, number of months, but not recently. But there are rumors that he's going to an endorsement that would be a great honor for me great honor mr president mutual respect among those with opposing perspectives is vital now more than ever trump's acknowledgement of rfk jr as a little bit different and a very smart guy highlights the power of intellectual diversity and strong character people deeply admire those who dare to think independently and challenge the norm and trump's words seem to endorse rfk jr for embodying these traits Furthermore, Trump's assertion that the Democrats treated RFK Jr. unfairly strikes a chord with conservatives who are increasingly concerned about the fairness and integrity of our political process. The struggles RFK Jr. might face within both political parties echo a growing frustration with a system that many believe stifles individual expression and true competition.